right, Greenleaf fans. Uh, yeah, just kind of catching up on the Jacob Carissa drama going on right now. I just wanted to ask the question: Do you think they should move out or stay in the Greenleaf mansion? I mean, it's a big home. Let's put it that way. Uh, let me just put it this way: I, I feel like the fact that um you get free room and board i believe they get their own wing of the house why would you want to move i mean honestly yeah the carissa may drama i can see how that's a factor but at the same time you know i you got to look at it from the security aspect of it um the fact that some of us you know had to or are still working jobs that you don't want it's almost like the let you have to weigh your options that's what i'm saying here like you just want to jump to get a house because you want to get out of the Greenleaf household and you want to be on your own and whatnot. And it's just one of these situations where, yeah, I think that's a dumb idea, especially because you've been conned before, as Lady May pointed out, when it, especially when it came to the furniture. And on top of that, it's like you you just seem ungrateful. I mean, yeah, like um, kids that live at home with their parents and they don't want to be there or hey, some people who are probably married or in relationships, but you are both on you know both signed on to the house or apartment you have and you really can't go anywhere it's like you want to leave but you know if you do it's not the well safety net you have of living with another person or persons and sharing the bills and whatnot because yeah you might be on your own and independent but you're going to be struggling and i think it's a dumb idea especially the fact that jacob just got fired from both jobs and on top of that um Carissa literally sold her soul or body, if you will, in order to get the house. Well, yeah, sell the land to get the house she wanted. And even then it's like, ooh, we only got half. And now to keep her mouth shut about the whole H&H funding the, you know, company that bought the land. Oh, here's the other half of that check. And if it clears, you come back and we'll do some stuff. So Carissa has definitely went out on a couple of limbs here. And it's only a matter of time before the branch snaps and then she falls. But it just seems like she's doing all this in order to move out. But at the end of the day, will it be worth it? So to be honest, I mean, why don't you just stay? I mean, because before she found out that um, Jacob had lost the job with the red devils and it couldn't move like that was right after her you know spat with lady may so it's almost like you know you <laughs> it, uh, i almost felt i mean carissa was telling the truth but at the same time i kind of felt bad in a way in the sense that but i laughed it's kind of like you know oh you walk into your job and you just tell everyone off your boss the supervisors co-workers you don't like about how how you have this great job that you have lined up or hey my husband or significant other they got a promotion and i get to quit my job and i don't have to work anymore but then as soon as you get home that night you find out oh you didn't get that other job or your significant other says you can't quit your job because he didn't get the job he thought he was going to get and now you got to walk in the next day with your head hung low looking dumb that's kind of like carissa if she hadn't gotten that second half of the check because remember if um Fernando didn't cut the other half of the check for her to be quiet in order for her to buy the house. You know, she would most likely still have to live with the green leaves and probably wouldn't even leave her room. So with that being said, you know, uh, should Jacob and Carissa stay? Yeah, I mean, well, hell, um, Bishop told Jacob not to sell the land. But like he said, I just want quiet. It's like, well, it won't give you peace. But yeah, I know you want to settle for quiet, but it's just about Tasha. That's all it is. Make sure she has a home with you first. And, you know, it's kind of interesting. She sells her soul in order to get the house she wants and then steps out on her marriage. And it's just like, I don't know. We'll just have to wait and see how things play out. But let me know what you think. Do you think Carissa was out of line? Do you think that her and Jacob should move? Do you think they should stay? I mean, to be honest, stay. But that's just my opinion. But with that being said, make sure you check me out on social media. Links are in the description below. Uh, make sure you subscribe to the channel if you are new. Leave your thoughts in the comment section below. And I will talk to you all soon.